I thought it would be interesting to show you guys how to burn an ISO file that you've downloaded from the internet. Say for example this Windows 7 ISO file. An ISO file is a disk image, so a full image, a full copy of a disk, complete, that is a burnable image, that's what it's called. So after you put your DVD-R in, that we're going to be using for this, it's going to give you a pop-up like this. It says you've inserted a blank DVD. Go ahead and choose Open with Disk Utility and hit OK. Uh, I already have Disk Utility open, so it's kind of just going to leave it here, right? Next thing you do is go over to your ISO and drag it and drop it into the left panel, right there. Okay? Not much is going to happen. Click that ISO file and then click Burn in the top now it says it's ready to burn as, as long as everything went well. Of course your Mac has to be capable of burning DVDs and then just hit burn. And now it will make an exact ISO copy of that particular disk. So this Windows 7 ISO is going to be exactly the same as if I had went on October 22nd and bought Windows 7.